Hey guys, right now I'm going to share with you the challenges or rather what was going on in my head after my second surgery, after experiencing a colostomy bag, which was a very, very difficult journey in my cologne cancer experience, I would say. I did not expect to go to the toilet 15 times a day. There was once, it was so frustrating, I stayed and slept in the toilet the whole night. I just sat in the toilet and started crying. I cried and would go to the toilet and cried again and I made a decision that I'm just going to stay in the toilet that whole night until my parents coaxed me to come out. So the first two months was a tremendous uphill battle for me and when I lay in bed that night, I thought to myself, tomorrow morning when I wake up, I'm going to be better. I'm going to be stronger. I'm going to be stronger day by day. After accepting that, coming to terms with the fact that I had to go to the toilet 15 times a day, it became easier. So after two months, I became more focused on my own body. I understood my body more. I meditated every day. That was the most important part of the journey of recovery, accepting that I have a new level of normal. To understand my body was one of the biggest steps. And also the second thing was meditation helped me prepare myself for the day to go out and lead a normal life or try to lead a normal life at least. It became easier day by day and how I handled it was of course I reduced my fiber at the beginning but now slowly I'm taking fiber back in doses and I drink Tom Woods diet which is sort of like an anti-cancer juice. I would eat food that was good for my body and not harmful. I would do things like sleep longer, sleep at least eight hours, drink more water. So I live by this motto, live each day as it comes. I want to hear your story. I've shared mine. So I can't wait to hear it. Comment below. Share it on my social media, your social media, hashtag share strength. And I love you. People around you love you. And we just want to hear from you.